we got the Gracianos today. Oh my God. He's an Elvis impersonator. He that works at the Holiday Inn. I mean, this guy, he's huge. He's huge here. I don't know why you couldn't drive yourself. But I love you, honey. Come here. Just let me help you up the No one but the food. You love a meatball Hold sandwich. On. I think I see the light, honey. I can't believe I married you. Yes, sir. I'm James Graziani. And Miss Brown, we're going to have to handle this one. Yeah, these are the, uh, I forgot your names already. Whoa. Why don't you step into my office? I watched the fat guy. He might do the point. If he does the point, get it on the camera. How you doing, baby? She's not your baby. So I'm the mediator. Thank you. I'm the mediator. What I'm here to do is try to help you facilitate an ending, a positive ending to this trauma that you're having. I want you to take a nice deep breath in, exhale, and say, Jesus loves me. Jesus loves me. That's just correct. sucked up all of my oxygen. Thanks oh, a lot. Whatever, baby. All right, so look, let's just straighten this I'm out. I'm not Scylla. Okay, now see, this is the part of that. And I just want to kill him. calm down. I can see. Uh, we're going to take this to the court and let the court decide. Yeah, we're going to let the court decide, baby. Oh, I'm so shaking my uh -huh. pants, baby. Yeah, am, am I going to have to put something right. between you two? Yeah, Canada. Yeah, you're about the right size of Canada. Right. Whatever. Miss Brown. Oh, just remember, Jesus does love you. We have. And Jesus we, doesn't love him. Oh, he does. Love Jesus loves everyone. The nature of the Elvis Presley. Because when it comes to that kind of music, I'm a big fan of the killer, Jerry Lewis. Look here, man. That guy couldn't even hold my blue suede shoes. I do three shows every weekend, every day of the week. I do two shows. And for those shows, I get $150, Your Honor. 150 big ones. And I get an extra $200 for the point. What's the point? Right here, baby. Good morning. I love you too, baby. Hot baby. She loves that dog more than she loves me. She even got a locket of the dog's fur right in her hair over there. I came home from work. It was 2 a.m. I sit down there, and I know it felt a little weird because, you know, a little lumpy down there, but I just thought that was the cushion coming up in me. I went to the bathroom afterwards. I looked in the toilet down there, and there was Fluffy. Pistachio. <gasps> Listen Pistachio. here, Priscilla. Priscilla, I'm talking. I am not. Priscilla. All right, well, look, the dog was in the toilet, all right? I don't know how it got there. Yeah, uh, Mrs. Graciano, it's your turn to tell us what happened, and uh, you got two minutes. Thank you very much. First of all, um, the defendant over here, Mr. Fat Meatball, um, decided when he got home the other night that he was going to take my pistachio's favorite chair and use it as his own. Your Honor, that's my chair. Don't interrupt me. Mr. Graciano, one more time. He comes in and he just sits right on my poor little pistachio's head, crushing its skull and popping out its little eyeball, okay? And so now my dog is a cyclops retard. I understand that you have some photographs, some evidence of the uh, damage to uh, Panacchio. Uh, Pan Pan I absolutely do with pistachio, please, pistachio. Here she is before and after, gorgeous as always. Mr. Graciano, how do you explain this? What have you done here? It looks like twins right there, man. You can smell the filthy women all over you. You don't think I know that? Look here, Priscilla. I can't help it if women like that over there come and see my show. Why are you referring to this woman right here? I'm What's saying going women on like between? that. Are you messing with my husband? No. I will wreck you, Blondie. Yeah. I, I will wreck you so hard. Yeah, write this down. This is, this is a good part. Write this down. Take it easy. In favor of Mrs. Graciano. <laughs> I order you, Mr. Fake Elvis, to pay her $635.45. And I want you to add another $75 to that. So did you take this beautiful woman out to a very romantic dinner? Because when she was talking about you, the words she said about you and how you were and everything, you could hear the love in her voice. All I'm saying to you too is, give love a chance. I'm gonna give love a whole chance. Why don't you give Jenny the chance? Uh, Graciano, good luck with uh, Panacchio. Panacchio, Panacchio. Yeah. All right, case closed. You're on it. Next case. Elvis has left the building. Yes, <laughs> yeah. Oh, I can't believe I won. No. I mean, I can't believe I won because, you know, you were pretty pathetic. But you know what? I'm so excited that Pistachio's going to get the operation. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. And then, like, I'm, I was thinking of doing, like, a whole, like, extreme makeover on him, doing, like, his hair. Like, maybe we got my Elvis present from right there. Yes, like yours. Like That's daddy's. Right. Yeah. And then maybe, Daddy, maybe we can go on vacation, like, somewhere, like, a little Graceland. Oh, yeah, we'll take the dog to Graceland.